I tell him, I love you. Eight letters, all caps, no spaces. Font the size of infinity. Spaces leave room for doubt and hesitation and I have neither when it comes to him. He takes my breath away, but he is my oxygen. Tank full of that good stuff. Cupid puffs fuel every chest pump he makes. My heart smile and my soul curtsy and that's perfect. And he's perfect for me and I for him. I should nickname him Vitamin. He is good for me. <laughs> he is yen and zen and I'm pretty sure he was birthed in Zion. Have, have you ever met God before? Because he reintroduces himself every time I look in his eyes. Father time often plays jokes and has me feeling like it was just yesterday and other times like it was years ago. So time and I often share chuckles <laughs> as these memories play of first kisses and instances. And I'm thinking reminiscing may just be my favorite. Right next to imagining I ever after I Never imagined that my love would grow like wildflowers along the pathway to my soul with him and, and all of his glory. See, he is my poetry, destined to reside within me. He is beautiful, no feminine intent in any sense of the word, but in every sense of its adoration. And, and, and I adore him with all five senses. My sixth sense is definitely loving him. My love stems from a deep root inside me, birthed from a seed that he showers daily in. And I shower him, wash him with peace and joy, bore two bundles of it in my womb and placed them in his arms. Heartbeats had never been that of sink before. We never created life and watched it breathe before our beautiful daughters. Perfect replica of their father's seed. He is the Boaz that church folks gossip about. He is the orchestrator of my smile, the percussionist to my heartbeat, the violinist to my heartstrings. He keeps me in tune, trouble kissing bass sun, dancing with the moon, my soul swoons every time my eyes rise to set on him. My vision rests in him. I guess he is my favorite view. He's direct the center of Nefertiti and Zeus, the queen of love and god of possible. He is my holy grail, the holder to the blueprint of I am forever. And I just want to love him. I just want to flood him with X's and O's and other gems. I want to nourish him. I want my love to stick to his bones. He has made my love his home. He rests there. My love is my king's castle. He is blessed there, and I am blessed by him. Reborn in his I love yous, I bask in him. Like one does the sun rays, he, he is my everything. It's perplexing that of all the things he's done for me, the most memorable thing was him showing me how to love me. It was the aid to me being able to love him better. And I make sure to start by always telling him, of course, 